Hey, it's Dave. January 23rd. Not a bad day. It's kind of sunny. Had a fire going earlier and did a lot of stuff around here. Straightening up. I can't stand messes. It's, a, it's just part of me. I just can't deal with it. So I had to come out here and do some stuff. Biggest thing I did, I'll show you in a second, was put together that shed from the campground and put everything back in it. Get the trailer, the camper set up the way it should be. So now it's ready to be cleaned on the inside and should be good to go for next time I need an overnighter. Which, who knows when that'll be. Anyways, that's not why we're here. Um, I'm gonna turn you around. We're actually out in the pistol range, which is right next to the camper, which is really cool. So, um, I wanna spend a little time shooting this new gun I got. And I showed it to you when Josh and Savannah are out here. But the Ruger Wrangler, it's a uh, 22 long rifle, um, six shot, uh, single action revolver. And it's very much like the Old West revolvers. And so it's um, pretty cool. The um, take me, It took me a minute to get used to it because of the single action, it's a little different. So uh, let me show it to you and I'm gonna run through how you load it and unload it and stuff because that's a little bit different. And you can take a look at it. And I'll put the specs up so you can see it. But uh, we're gonna shoot at a bunch of steel. So let me show you, flip you around. All right, so there you go. It's the Ruger Wrangler. It's a mouthful. And you can tell I got the bronzed version. They all have the, I don't know, it's like, looks to me like coyote, but it's it's caracote finish on it, um, which makes it very durable. But anyways, I like the, I like the look of that one. So, um, and here's with ammo we're shooting Remington uh, Golden Bullet. It's a target bullet that I got. It's 40 grain. Um, the neat thing about the single action revolver, it's it's gonna shoot pretty much anything. But it took me a minute to get used to. So let me run run through some stuff with you. So hold on. All right. So keep it so you can see. But to load this, it's a little bit different. You can see even different than your double action revolver where the cylinder you know flops out and you can put your bullets in with this you got a little door you have to flop open and once you do that the cylinder moves freely so you take a you would take a bullet and you stick it in there and that's how you load it and then you load six it holds six when you're done close that door and then you gotta turn till you hear a click now you're ready to shoot. To um, unload it, it's the same procedure. You line up a bullet or line up your cylinder hole and then you have this little push rod right here, right? So you push that rod, see how it comes out? Boom, it shoots that empty cartridge right out. Then you roll, rotate it to the next one and depress, rotate to the next one, depress, there you go through. Now, so you can see, you yeah, gotta do this real fast, right? So it's gonna take a little bit of time. And it's part of what you gotta get used to is shooting it and it's, you know, how things all line up and stuff. So anyway, um, I like that part of it. And for me, I'm gonna just flip you back around again. So we'll shoot it here in a minute. We got a bunch of targets set up, so. All right, so for me, that's the, I think that's the first gun I ever bought that isn't utilitarian for me. I always, every other gun had some kind of a purpose, even, you know, whether it's self-defense or hunting, most, almost all my guns are hunting. So even my AK, you could say it's you know, self-defense. So this, I got it. Because I want to, I have a goal. I want to try to get good enough where I can do a cowboy action shoot. So, and I want to see if I was could handle the revolver and you know to do good with that. So, anyways, that's why I did it. So, we're gonna I'm gonna set you up here in a in a second, and then uh, 
I'll do a variety of shooting. I have um comment. Turn it around. Hey, look, there's that the shed I put up today. It's full of stuff. Including targets. So we got a couple plates of steel. And I got some little run fire targets over here. And so probably do most of the shooting from right about here, which is about 10 yards. So we'll do that. I might back up a little bit too to see, but I doubt it. I think most of it I'm gonna do from right around that area. So but we'll see. We'll see how it plays out. All right, David. Oh, that's pretty fun. I am going to back up a little bit. So let me stop you for a little bit. Hey, so I'm going to shoot from 15 yards. And uh, I just let me add that this is like the common guy perspective. You know, I don't know all the correct pronunciation, all the names and stuff. And we just go and have a little fun out here. And so that's the purpose. I'm, no, I'm not a pro. So. I don't claim to be, but I do like to shoot. So I think that's something everybody can have in common. All right, 15, 15 yards. Let's see what we do. Her. All right. Flip around and do the Dave out. Oh, there you go. That's the Ruger Wrangler. Cool little uh, single action pistol. I enjoy it. I can I can see why people like shooting Hell West guns. I love lever actions. You know, I like shotguns. Seems to me to be a natural fit. But... What do I know? 
anyway we'll see where it goes gotta hope uh ammo prices go down a little bit and i can get more serious about it but for now i can plank around with this ruger wrangler even hit some of these small little targets so that's not bad all right like i always say remember to be kind make kindness your business and uh hope you have a a great day hey thanks for watching all right dave out